Today was the first day of the Wright County Fair in Eagle Grove, but the fairgrounds are still flooded from excessive rain over the weekend. And today, Governor Reynolds declared a disaster proclamation for the county. KCCI's Ophelia Jacobson was at the fairgrounds as organizers say it's full steam ahead. Dozens of floats, tractors and cars made their way through Eagle Grove Tuesday afternoon. The parade is really the best kickoff to the Wright County Fair. People say this is a staple of the community. Everybody just gets to come to the county and just have fun all together and everybody just hangs out all the time. But getting to opening day hasn't been easy this year. As you can see behind me, the, the water's still flowing and that is our grandstand area. So Fair manager Trisha Rosendahl says some of the water left behind by flash flooding has started to recede. The rest of the fairgrounds, she says, is looking good. But the water that's still here is forcing organizers to make tough decisions, like canceling Thursday's rodeo. It's really heartbreaking to, to do that because that is one of our most popular events in the grandstand. Rosendahl says they've already scheduled a concert for Thursday night in place of the rodeo. Vendors are also having to make adjustments. For the first time in 10 years, Sweet Treats Ice Cream Company is setting up here instead of over there. They told us that if we tried to park our unit over there, that we'd probably sink three or four feet into the mud. Jan Miller says she's excited to be in a different location this year. It's not the only thing that's new. This year we're trying cones. Miller says they're ready to serve favorite flavors. Mint chocolate chunk, one of the favorites up here. With the side of sweet optimism. It doesn't benefit you or anybody else to be down in the dumps about it. You just need to go with the flow. Going with the flow is not always easy when you're dealing with a massive flow of water. But Rosendahl says seeing the crowds flow into the fairgrounds. People want to be here, so come out and enjoy the fun together. And seeing the appreciation pour in. I'm just glad that is happening and that it didn't get canceled or postponed. Makes the hard work worth it. In Eagle Grove, Ophelia Jacobson, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.